Hey guys and welcome back to a brand new episode and in today's episode we are going to be raiding this pillar base that we ended up finding on score stuff. However, just before we get into all of that shenanigans, I hope you guys are having a fantastic day and of course if you do enjoy today's episode, please make sure to leave a like and the sub. We passed 9,000 subscribers of course, we're way on beyond that now. So let's try and get to that 10k very very soon and without further ado, I hope you guys do enjoy. But just before we start today's episode, here's a quick word from today's sponsor. Today's sponsor is Shadow Fibercraft. This server is a Windows slash Xbox only server, so unfortunately you Steam guys can't play it unless you have the Microsoft version of of arc this server also comes with custom keys active admins plenty of custom drops and of course on top of all of that events and giveaways but even better the server has a $100 cluster alpha reward if you become the top tribe on the server the server is also 100x with four times turret damage and on top of all of that it's got insta levels and insta tame and of course if you don't want to get raided they do offer private servers that you can play on but without further ado i hope you guys do check it out the link is of course on screen and down in the description but without further ado let's get into today's episode what's it called you need to be more like over the edge i just don't want to let you like chuck it weirdly yeah, the oh this ledge is full right, go bro what is to going to the stego don't Mind. Yeah, that's one way to start an episode. And as you can see, we ended up finding this base. We weren't expecting much because they only had heavy tourists. However, the actual inside and what we got from this base is absolutely insane. So you do need to stick around. Jesus Christ, that was one hell of a grapple glitch. I got all the way up down from the bottom. All the way up. Oh, that was sick. Alright. What are we working with then? How do we... Okay. What's this? You need you to come here and kill me. Please. Yeah. yeah, one sec. So after having a nice little look and seeing what the base was like and seeing what we could really do to raid this easy without really complicating things. So I think we just decided, you know what, best way to do it, let's just try and soak as much as possible. It didn't seem like they had many bullets at the start. However, they definitely had more than just about 200 bullets. Have you got Kate? Yeah. I'm pulling all of them in my stego. A UT here probably would have came in handy. So, soaking was definitely not an option. These guys had way too much ARB for us to soak it efficiently. So, what I was looking at here at this point is any way that we could possibly cheese the base. And because of the design of the base, it was very, very weird. And we ended up finding a nice little grapple spot. Tom, can you give me some C4? Uh, currently right outside of their base. Wait, they have a tech generator since when did they have tech? Tom, if you look at the right side of that base. Um, the right side left of that base, left side, yeah. Left side. Left, left side of the base. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I see ya. Morning. Can you get Jen? Uh, bro, 44 slots of bullets. What? You guys are farmers. The towers outside have normal gens in. Uh, why is it? I think it's in here where I am right now. I messed it up. All the turrets now are all capped. So if we can cheese it, it's actually a decent chunk of Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna try my very best to try and do something. I don't promise anything, but I promise something, hopefully. 
I think. I'm not really sure. Doing something. If it works, it works. If it doesn't, it doesn't. No way Stego doesn't fit in here. Bruh. How does a Stego not fit in there? Oh, and I'll get shot from there as well. Oh, bro, this is... <sighs> it's not looking good. I mean, you've actually blown everything up that has loot in it, man. All the fucking fabbies and the smithies, so you need... Fire. Yeah, there's about half an hour. Attempting this from a different side. Heavy gun. Yeah, 43 slots of bullets. Ah, crazy, bro. on him. Nope. God's sake. This is a lot a lot harder to cheese than I thought it would be. Hey these guys have got ascendant full flak. Oh not worth it eh what? Yeah but it's ascendant. How's it going? Pretty bad. Pretty bad is because I can't I can't actually get to my body without being absolutely lasered. Yeah. <sighs> if I had more rockets it'd be a little bit more easier. Let's bad drop this. I didn't drop shit, man. It dropped. Oh, actually, never mind, it dropped it. Can I come in now then? Uh, well, technically, yeah, if you come from the same side that I went in from, yeah. Alright, this is my kit. There's my second kit. I'll end up here with a smile. No, uh, yeah, you can probably land up here with a smile. Bro, so much ARB. We're taking all of that, I'm sorry, but we are. We're actually hey, taking all this ARB. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, they do have a full flag set, BB. Oh. Well, I actually want to kill myself. Don't think about that one, eh? And the bed's on cooldown. Oh! Why would you not think of putting flak on? I kind of forgot I didn't have it on because I was just trying to avoid heat. Five minutes later. All right. Oh, God. Uh, let me get the blueprints. Mm. Nothing 
else in there. Nothing else. Oh, ARB. These guys are just ARB farmers. Thousand silk. Ooh. Bro. These guys are cracked at farming. So much gunpowder. Like, absolutely crazy. Bro, I'm just caps them. Don't, don't take the flint. Yeah. Don't take the flint. I'll go on a flint run. But, it's still crazy. I can't... These guys... They must have donated, right? Well, it's a full, like, literally, it's a full flag set. It's just a full flag set of Ascendant BPs. So, yeah. it's definitely been. Uh, it's the, the definitely been donated don't. for, I think. But it's just so. Sh why would you donate and live here? Listen, maybe, maybe it's a good base location. Maybe we're just saying bad things about it. Maybe it's way better than we think. You never know. I doubt that. You think? We've not been there. Oh. <laughs> Can't be that good. Right, I'm sorry, but they've built it very badly, so. True. It's lagging. 42 element. <laughs> nice. Um, you know how you mentioned that they're powered by gas gens? What have what has I found? They have Donal Reapers. I feel bad, but I don't. I'll, I'll gladly um, take Dodo Reapers. Little Destroyers. Yeah, that's them. That's, that's these guys. Yeah. L l yeah. L I L. -L. They got a Phoenix, bro. <laughs> Dodo Reapers. Bro, they got. Our Giggers? <laughs> a Phoenix? What? Oh, it's a good. Hold on, is it a good Phoenix? Yeah, it's like 260. It's a good phoenix. Move. Go on. Eh. Nah. Shit. It's like the stone hatcher oh, I, I think can do it. Good. This has ARB in it. What has? I brought for some C4. Oh. Come. 400 points. Less? Do you want to get in this middle one? Hold on, I'm getting into this. Never mind. No, I'm not getting into it. Uh, for some reason, that one's just. I think that one's just covering the gen, so I don't think that one will have that. Go! Oh. 23 rockets. Yes, sir. Look, crafted flag. See? This is like, this is all by them. Yeah. Is it what? Is it a solo? No, it was a duo. They've clearly done a boss fight, because obviously they have a tech gen. But they don't have tech maturing. Bye. This is, this is their dono stuff, bro. Bro, this is the dono stuff. You get dust, you get element in the base pack, and you get dust. Well, they, so they got a base pack. They got so a base they got pack, dust. and they have early dust. Yeah, they got early dust from it. That's a lot of early though, bro. That's like one, two, three, four, five, six, six, six seven, twenty-four, like, 30, 36, 42. Uh, 42, 42 slots. What? It's twenty-four, it's two hundred and twenty-five k dust. So that's like two hundred and. 20 early. It's a lot. And he probably spent it's like 25. It's probably the lowest base pack, but either way. <laughs> Come on. Wait, it's 500 dust for an Ellie Dom, so it's double yeah, that, so, so it's 500 Ellie worth of dust. Yep. Yep. The $60 pack. Decent. Easy. So, wait, so these guys donated $60. Bye. Bye. And lived here. Wait for me. That's why I'm waiting. <laughs> I 
Yes! Oh, fat bag. Uh, Either way, bro, look at the ARB. I don't know, let me yeah, just blow this left. one head. Bang. 41 slots. <laughs> and there's. Do you get ARB with the base packs? Towers. Yeah, you get ARB with the base packs. Ah, uh, that would be it. That's why they can't. Move. Move. You guess you're far Alright, go. Did you, did you not put one on it? Oh, oh. shit. Bye. Oh, wind turbine. <laughs> so where's the rep? I swear you get a rep with this ba with base packs. All right, it don't matter. We we've hit the jackpot. I think you know it's a about a deady of ARB that you get with a base pack. If not, possibly more. Fifty-five yeah, slots. Oh, did they all fall dead? No. Oh, no, because they built this very nice ramp for us. 58, 58. Yeah, it's all cap ram black box. Oh, these indie forges. I'm black box. I kind of want in these. I just don't get it, because how long have these. They've been off long enough to the point where their generators have died. Yeah. Well, generators don't take that long to die. So, well then, the one on the tower was still standing. True. I don't know. Basically, what you want to do is not complain, and uh, we'll take it. Oh, well. Oh no, Reapers will come in handy. I, I guess. Yeah. Wait, but hold on. No, no, Tom, there's a Power Jenny bag here. There was a Power Jenny bag in the other one. And then turn on then. They don't turn off during a storm. Well, they must have just never turned them on in the first place. Nah, bro. They must have done them before they got tech. These guys are weirdos. Uh, Some bags might have fallen down. No, oh no, you, you probably sold it. Yeah, you sold it for it once, I think. So, you might have heard a confusion about how did their turret towers go down, even though that they had power generators inside of them. And let me tell you this real quick we actually forgot that the new update that they literally brung out, I think, like the day or two before this video was actually recorded, they bring out an update where generators on Scorched Earth didn't actually break, they just turned off so basically what happened a storm came along turned off their power generator and now they were only left with a tech gen which obviously doesn't turn off however their generator never comes back on unless it is manually turned on which made our raid a little bit easier let's just say that much we got so much loot we had to go straight back and then we ended up going over and doing the manticore just to get some engrams however that's going to be it for today's episode and the series unfortunately nothing else happened after this we actually ended up just basically quitting because there was no other bases that we could realistically raid without putting in too much time but i hope you guys did enjoy and of course if you did please make sure to leave a like and a sub and i hope you guys are looking forward to the next series peace out